it's definitively the last season of this of this story that we're that we're saying that that, that I can say. There's lots of variables with all that stuff, but the first and foremost is is you know the stories, the stories, the characters. <laughs> If season one was about, you know, the fight within the within the club between Ted and Rebecca and Ted and Roy Kent, etc. Uh, and second season was about the fight inside of each of those individuals, I'd say season three is about how AFC Richmond as a team, as, a, as an organization, as a chosen family uh, deals with the various conflicts uh, and, and antagonisms of life and sport. Hey coach, I don't know about you, but it kind of feels like it's getting a little stuffy in here. Yeah. Like one of those days you want to have class outside. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what the f are you two talking about? We are outside. Ted is, uh, you know, he'd spent the, the majority of the off season with his son in London, uh, who is off school. And uh, he's just sitting with those questions within him. You know, why am I here? Is this the right decision? Is this the right choice? Is there another way to go about living this life, even though it's a little bit outside of the house and the you know, nuclear family and, and yeah, so Ted's just trying to navigate, you know, if he's if he's doing the right thing and, and for the right reasons. Regarding my panic attacks, I've had more psychotic episodes than Twin Peaks. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm so crazy. Uh, I'm crazy. crazy. Yeah, I am. There we go. <laughs> we wrote a series finale and um, it was a scene in the locker room. And we, and then everybody filed in there. A lot of tears, a lot of cheers, a lot of clapping. And um, it felt like, you know, an actual sports, <laughs> you know, team, you know, having their, after their final game, but without knowing if we've won or lost, you know, which is really not, a, as Ted says, not the most important thing. So in many ways we won. And, and, and there, there was just this um, feeling, like a call to arms that to take whatever we made here and however we made it there to bring that to wherever we, any of us go next. I hear people loud and clear. I take it as, we all do, take it as a compliment that people would want would want more, but the stories have to service that endeavor. It, can, it can't be the other way around. But this is this story is being told the way we want it to be. We, we had hoped and, and dreamed that it would be told, and, and the fact that we got to do that is is thrilling enough. But uh, but yeah, I can't give you a, a definitive answer of, of if it were to come back and, and not you know put myself up, set myself up for being called a, a a liar, you know, moons from now. <laughs> it's definitively the last season of this of this story that we're that we're saying. That, that that I can say. There's lots of variables with all that stuff, but the first and foremost is is you know the stories, the stories, the characters.